Hi guys, I'm still on Garuda, but it's Garuda and then start uh, running the Arclix Nemesis script and install all kinds of stuff like our Arclix Tweet Tool, which I'll probably rename to Arch Linux Tweet Tool because it's anything based on Arch Linux is what we teach on Arclix. Anything that works on Arclix will work on Endeavor as will work on Garuda, etc. etc. Thing is that leftwm didn't work. And we tried to install it with Arclix Tweet Tool, but I do have a file which I'm currently not using. So in the current choices, I have always run, I did run install leftwm because that's the combo I would like to have. 90% of the time on I will be on leftwm and 10% on XFCE, and that will be my 2022 workflow. So this hashtag is basically holding me back. So install leftwm. Let's see what conflicts because here it's a file per file, line per line, and we'll see what's not working. make font main scale seems to be missing some kind of font some commands i mean hmm looks like everything is installed just fine and it did so it's something in the tweak tool Polybar. Polybar is not installed. Aha. Super Shift Enter did something. Pseudo Pacman minus S Polybar. That is installed. Scale. It's not found locally. Thunar making it big won't help me so there is something going on aha that's super shift q super shift q super shift q and that's too much let's try to get into control so etc scale control h everything that's in here has to go in here, replace all. Super shift R. All right, that's better. Ah, everything is working. So I've got myself left WM on Garuda, which is basically gone at this point in time. Well, NeoFetch probably will know. NeoFetch knows. So that's okay. I see. It's not our bash RC. Bash Garuda. It's our bash personal. Bash RC. So that's something to check out because update, of course, is not known. Up all is not known. So what happened to my Bash RC, basically? The Bash RC is not there. Okay. Pseudo Pacman minus S A D scale git now the bash rc is there control a control c control v replace all super x 
log out, log back in. Super Q, Super Q, Super Q, Control T. And that works. Update. We're back. Bash RC is gone. Was gone. Is back. This is something not from us. From Garuda. I will be patient. In the meantime, I clean up my system. Wow. Too much. All right. Let's do something else while we're being patient. Redshift. virtual box but it's there that's in sync variety to have the next wallpaper and that's working just fine and then maybe in the meantime while we wait lt updates not found locally lt uh -huh. <laughs> We have to figure out who's overwriting the bash RC. Who's doing that? Who is overwriting the bash RC? You see, it's gone again. Some kind of guardian. In the meantime, we're up to date. Uh -huh. From uninstalling Aspel. Okay. So, Pacman, what was I thinking? Ah, oh, yeah. So, the Bash RC, scale is not working. So, something is overwriting the Bash RC. So something is often in computer, file system, etc. System. Ah. Let's kill a few windows. And then system D system let's have a look display maintenance service going for packages multi-user target ones system D um, service network modem the snapper guest lock It's red. It's not working. It's broken. A broken link and a broken link. Who is doing that, right? Someone. So it seems only for these guys. Okay. So we're not closer to a solution. Let's see what we have. 
lines remove Garuda. That's what we have. Where is Pamac Tray? It's not loaded, is it? Or is that, am I not seeing the icon? No, Pamac Tray. Garuda Assistant, what does it do? Files Bash Config. Uh -huh. Bash RC setup. It's gonna do something. I don't think I want you to do that. Bash RC. How to start? I'm not seeing it. Bash RC setup. Ah, it is his Kalerg. Okay. All right, that one has to go. I have my own bash RC. Garuda bash config. Garuda bash config. Garuda bash config. Garuda. Remove, Eric. Remove, remove. So, then we go up here. We hit pull, and we go for number four hundred. He's gonna remove that thing and I would like to do number 100 again for my bash RC scale doesn't know scale not yet let's see it's the scale control H bash RC Little Pacman minus S uh, we do spell git. Okay. Control A, Control C, Control V, replace all. Okay, still mine. Let's reboot, see what happens. I want, of course, my own Bash RC to keep there, to stay there. And uh, my own fish and my own ZSH. Do not touch. Because a ball. Still working. And update. And scale if I want to. I think that's that was a good thing. Let's try again. I 
And let's try again. So I wanted to type, go away. I wanted to type this one. Ah, it's working. And then I can install my latest love. Nemesis. If you can install it. You can also apply it. Now this is a search, right? It, it needs to find GitHub and it needs to git pull everything and yeah, I don't know why, but sometimes it's just slow. Apply Nemesis. Voila, we've got ourselves Nemesis Super Shift R. Reload again, so the, the red line there is gone. And this is our new system. And it really doesn't matter if I started with Endeavor OS. I have what I need. I have left WM, I have my theme, I have all my icons up here. And if I install, that's a big if, if I install Firefox, it will work. If I install Discord, it will have Discord, it will have Telegram. I can make a screenshot. Uh, screenshot is not installed. So sudo pacman minus s flame shots. It is already installed. Let's see if the keyboard shortcut works. There is a problem with flame shot. Okay. And this one should be calculator sudo pacman minus s. Don't know the application anymore what it's called. It's a calendar, basically. This is in sync. This is simple screen recorder. And that's Vivaldi. It's all available. It's all there. Don't show. Okay. Voila. Change background. There you are. And the menu is working. I'm good. I am on Garuda. Did my thing with it. And I have left WM. And if you don't want to have redshift, pseudo pacman minus remove. Yep, redshift is there. And then it's gone. Now you can do this over and over and over again, or you can go to the remove file and say, never mind, redshift. Don't want it. Next time around, after a clean install of Garuda, I'll run this script. This is gone, that's gone, that's gone, that's gone. And I'll be a happy boy. And I'll have my Garuda the way I want it. So think out of the box, make your own scripts. The scripts here have been created to be installed or used, of course, my vision. So use it as a template and change it. If you use an ALCI ISO, ALCI.online. If you use Arch Linux.org ISO. If you use an Arch Linux ISO, 41 of those. If you use a riser, um, seven I think, of those. If you use Carly, one of those. EOS, also kind of five, six or something. KDE, GNOME, XFCE. Garuda, choose, right? Now it was Garuda where we had this choice. Anyway, use an ISO, an Arch Linux based ISO, and make it any way you like it. All right, another example how to analyze things, how to script things. Cheers. One last thing before I really end this. Let's make this image an image you recognize. It's all Arch Linux, IT, right? IT, it is all Arch Linux. Made in the Lodge B with you. Go to the Arch Linux website, watch the Arch Linux videos. And after five years of developing, I get this in my brain. It's all Arch Linux. Think out of the box, please.